Shalom Chavrim, this is Richard Solomon, and this will be a demonstration, or if you like, a tutorial on how you use an iOS app called Storehouse. Storehouse is an app that enables the Judaic teacher or student to tell stories that relate to Judaic themes through using an iOS device. By an iOS device, I am referring to an iPhone, a, uh, an iPad, or an iPad mini. And I'm also making an assumption that uh, you, the listener, are able to download your uh, free iOS app, this storehouse, onto your iOS device. So what I propose to do is first show you how an example of how Storehouse can be used for Judaic instruction, and then I'll show you actually how I used Storehouse to uh, create a story related to the many faces of uh, Judaic, uh, of the Jewish people. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to tap on Storehouse. And we'll show you that I created this um, kind of a story about the many different faces of the Jewish people. And uh, we'll just go through this and then I'll give you an idea of how I made this. So the first thing we're going to do is show you that um, here's a picture that I had in my camera roll which suggests that some Jewish people are physically challenged. Okay. Let's continue. And then I have different pictures of uh, Jewish people of different colors. Okay, you see that? And uh, different sizes and different family uh, constellations. Okay, so let's show you how this was actually made. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to tap on this circle here. Okay and it gives you a box in which you can place your pictures. Now you could place your pictures from iPhoto, Dropbox, Instagram, Flickr, or Lightroom. Okay, I'm gonna make it simple for us. I'm gonna create a story uh, for you and we'll use this template that was given. And all I'm going to do is click on where it says iPhoto Library, okay? So we'll do that and we'll look at uh, some uh, pictures of different Jewish people, okay? This is just an example. So uh, I will uh, select from this. Let's see. Let's take uh, this picture, okay? And we'll show uh, different kinds of uh, pictures of uh, Jewish people. This is just an example, okay? Let's see, I take this picture. You know, you could take anyone you want. Here's a one who's different. And, uh, you know, it really, really doesn't matter. So here we are. Then we're going to indicate that those were the ones we selected. And we'll uh, import those. We hit import. And we see here... Uh, different kinds of Jewish people. In this case, as you probably know, this is uh, Bernie Madoff. And then we write a title over here, but we're just going to call this Demo. Okay, so I'll just hit uh, D for a demonstration, right? Demonstration. It's a demonstration of how to use Storehouse. And if, when you finish, you click on this particular keyboard. If you like, you can have a um, subtitle. And here we have uh, different kinds of pictures, right? That we just selected, right? And we can either make it into a draft or we can publish it. So let's say we wanted to uh, publish it. So we just click on publish over here. And now it's uh, published. So if we wanted to uh, see it, we just go back to storehouse 
and uh, there it is. Uh, continue editing, what have you. But uh, basically, uh, we have uh, published this. See, it says your story is published. And when it's done, okay. And uh, here we have the two stories. The one story was the original one here, and here is the second one that was the demonstration. So what have we said? What we have said is that Storehouse which is right over here, is a free storytelling app that uh, enables Judaic students and teachers to create their own uh, pictorial and text stories through using this particular iOS app. Thank you so much.